Hey everyone, DuckNuck84 here, and now we are in Spain in another part of the adventure of Broken Sword. And let's go talk to the gardener. And get wet in the process. Hi, is this the DeVasconcellos house? Who wants to know? I could tell the old coup was going to be trouble. My name's George Stobar. I was wondering whether the house is not open to the public. This is the DeVasconcellos house. And what business is that of yours, senor? Look, all I want is to speak to the head of the household. There is no household. Only the countess and myself. That hose looks weird. The animated part and the non-animated part don't match up well. What do you know about the Templars? Who wants to know? George Stobart. Are you for a bribe or something? You have nothing that I want, senor. Except the pleasure of your absence. The guy was obviously protecting the Countess against the whole world, but why? Because he's the gardener. Tell me about the Countess de Vasconcelos. She doesn't receive guests. That's all you need to know. You don't even know what I have to talk to her about. She hasn't won the lottery, has she? No. No, she hasn't won the lottery. A more cunning man might have claimed that she had. But I'm an honest oh, yeah. man. They might have, might they? And that more cunning man would have been kicked off the premises. The Countess doesn't do the lottery. Well, that's why she didn't win the lottery, because she doesn't play the lottery. Would you like to shake hands? I do not think so, senor. Okay, I don't think you're going to be interested in any I'll of that. i going, for now. Adios, senor. And I'm wet again. I can go over there. The main part of the house was old, but nowhere near as old as the gatehouse section. And he's not going to let me in there. Let's see if we can go over to the gazebo or veranda or whatever, whatever those things are. Whatever you call those things. Mausoleum, maybe? From a distance, I thought it might be a summer house. Close up, I wasn't so sure. Nope, it's a mausoleum. Although we could see it has something to do with the Templar from the cross there. Oops, wait a sec, what's... I wasn't about to go clambering on rooftops if I didn't have to. So I was going to say, that staff looks kind of like the one that was in the church. Okay, I think I remember what we have to do here. Surprising that I can remember some of these puzzles when I can't remember other details about the game. Let's see, if we try to go in, he's going to stop us. Hey, you. Yeah, what is it? You would not like it if people just wandered into your home, would you? It happens all the times in games. No, I guess not. Then show a little consideration. Okay. Uh, sorry. In fact, they come into my house and steal all my stuff. And there's nothing I can do. I can't even call the guards on them. Okay, so... He's got the hose out here. I didn't like the idea of carrying 30 yards of hose around me, so I left it alone. In fact, also because it was in use. Well, what we're going to do is take the blood pressure cuff, put it on the hose, Not pump it up at all, even though that's what we actually are doing. Stupid hose. My hose has stopped. Well, they have pills yeah. and you should probably hey, see a doctor for that. My hose never stops. Well, I'm sorry to hear it. It's always sad when an old tradition comes to an end. Did you have anything to do with it? No. Well, I'm shocked. I'm mortified. How could you think such a thing? 
Very easily, senor. This is an adventure very game. Easily. I'm going to find out why my horse has stopped. And that means going into the house. You are not, absolutely not, to go in the house. If you do go in the house, I will set the dogs on you. Anyway, like I was saying, how can he suspect me? This is an adventure game. The hero's always the reason things happen. I'm going in the house. And down that way. Nope, not going that way. Maybe I... Oh, yeah, do I have to hide behind here? He will never see me. Hey, you. I know you are there, American. All right, you dogs, I'm coming. Yeah, uh, he's right there. You walked right past him. He is completely blind. Let's check here in case we need anything. It was a small mirror hanging over the sink. From the scum in the sink, it looked like he shaved there. That's disgusting. It was just a little utility room with no exit, unless you counted the window. And I didn't. And because I can't fit out there. Well, anyway, let's go see the Countess. Madre Dios, who are you? My name's George Stobart. I'm sorry to burst in like this. You must leave at once. You're not wanted here. Please, if you just listen a minute. Very well. State your business, Senor Stoba. There's been a series of murders, part of some conspiracy. Anyway, the trail led me here. Here? There is nothing for the outside world here. Over 600 years ago there was. What do you mean? This whole thing ties in somehow with the Knights Templar. The Knights Templar are dust. They had a secret that was so important, they went to a lot of trouble to hide it. I do not see what this has to do with my family. Your family had a strong connection with the Templars, right? I believe that they have planted some clues here. <laughs> Why should I believe like that a shield. complete stranger who barges into my home? Just let me have a look around. If I find nothing... You'll be spending the night at the police. Not the first time. Very well. Please, sit down. So, how was your family connected to the Templar? I know your family is involved with the Templars, but I don't know how. You should be asking how my family were involved, Senor Stobart. The Templars ceased to exist centuries ago. And as for the De Vasconcelos, the line dies with me. I'm sorry. Don't be. Okay, whatever happened, happened almost 700 years ago. So, if the Templars left any clues, they're going to be in stuff that dates back to the early 14th century. Obviously. So, what do you have around here that's early medieval? What don't you have? Early medieval. Let me think. Well, the house is relatively modern, a scant three centuries old. Or, of course, the chess set. That chess set is over 600 years old? It must be worth a fortune. Indeed it is. Not that I would part with it, of course. No, I wouldn't either. Uh, that's the sort of thing that gets handed down to your children. Which you don't have. S sorry. <laughs> its value is less than you might think. The set is not complete. One of the pieces is a modern replacement. As to the original, it was lost a long time ago. Nobody has any idea where it is? No. The children had it when they were taken. Children? What children? All in good time, Senor Stobart. So about that chessboard. May I examine the chess set? Certainly, but do not move any of the pieces. I have a game okay, going. Thanks. Yeah, it's a chessboard. Close up, the modern piece stood out like a sore thumb. There was something else odd about the set. All of the original pieces had irregular bases. My lady, I have to warn you, there's a... Guy sitting in your chair? You! Why, I feed you to the dogs. Lopez, what have I told you about feeding intruders to the dog? But, my lady, never without my permission. Besides, we have nowhere else to hide the bodies anymore. 
Senor Stobart, if I find that you're wasting my time, you will be fed to the dogs. Now, I want to show you something interesting. Follow me. Lopez, unlock the door, por favor. This is the only remaining structure on the estate contemporary with the Templars. Nice. What is it, a summer house? A mausoleum, Senor Stobart. Oh. Come with me. We kind of figured that out before, George, so why are you say, trying to make a joke hey, about it? Senor. Yeah? I do not know what you have told my lady to be shown these favors, but I do not trust you. You've got nothing to worry about. Aren't you coming in? No, the dead do not interest me. My garden is a living thing. I will be there. Wow, this is old. It was constructed in the 13th century as the final resting place for the De Vasconcellos Templars. It's well maintained. These are my ancestors, and they deserve respect. I come here at least once a week to say a prayer for them. Mind if I have a look around? Uh, by all means. Just don't touch anything. The mausoleum contained five tombs for five of the Knights Templar, man size in marble. But there's a, obviously they were going to put one there. Nothing there. What about this book? On removing the Bible, I found a pattern on the lectern top. Hey, it's a checkerboard. How convenient. A big statuette of the Virgin Mary kept an eye on the place. And... That's what to... Now what? There was nothing to snuff. Feeling like an idiot, I put it down again. Okay, so that's going to be for something later. Let's look at this then. Close up. I could see that the pattern was made up of glass squares over a checkerboard pattern. Well, that obviously means we gotta use the chess pieces. May I ask you something? Uh, you may ask. But let's go through this first. Who exactly are these people? My ancestors. These five men were all members of the Templars. Five ancestors in the Order. You must be very proud. Not five. Six. Where's the sixth knight? He was lost to us. You lost an ancestor? It is a family matter. It can have no relevance. Well, it's connected with the curse of the de Vasconcellos, isn't it? Yes, it is. I hope you will honor my desire not to talk about it. Okay, well, I'll leave it for now. But I'm coming back to it. Is the Virgin Mary really the right person to be sharing a mausoleum with five knights? You are showing your ignorance, Senor Stobart. The Templars were dedicated to the Virgin Mary. Okay. You certainly know your history. What's your opinion of the Templars, Senor Stobart? The Templars? Well, they seem no worse than a lot of the knightly orders. You are mistaken. Compared to the simpering politicians of the hospitalers or the brutish Teutonics, the Knights Templar were the embodiment of chivalry. The filthy, money-grabbing French king and his pet pope did a great wrong. A bane settled upon my family at the whim of that self-seeking tyrant. It was all a long time ago. Some things don't die. Injustice is one of them. Well, the good thing that I'm here to fight for justice! And chessboard. What's the story with the glass chessboard? Glass chessboard? Oh, the pattern on the lectern. Purely decorative, I'm sure. I don't think so. There are pieces of glass missing from it. Oh, it has been like that since I was a girl. The gaps in the glass chessboard look awfully deliberate. No, it is ridiculous. What possible significance can it have? It's part of a chessboard, and the gaps are for... Senor Stobart, 
You cannot mean... This place was built for the Templars. Your chess set is as old as the Templars. It's kind of suggestive, isn't it? Why, yes it is. I think this must be it. This is what the manuscript is pointing to. This is extraordinary. Am I to understand that the Templars left a puzzle here? And in all of this time, we failed to realize that there was a puzzle? It was wonderful to watch the Countess change before my eyes. Right. Well, no time for wallowing in self-pity, eh, Senor Stobart? This mystery has had a good long run, but it ends here and now. All those years of fatalism were falling away from her. Lopez! Lopez! Put that hold down and listen! Go to the house and get my chest set. Yes, the old chest set. Now hurry. Am I? This is exciting, is it not? Don't get too excited. I, this could be a blind alley. Oh, I do not believe that for a moment. It's good to see you happy. Happy? <laughs> you know, I think I am. So, while we're waiting... While we're waiting, I'd really like to know what happened here. I mean, the curse and everything? It all began at the time of the dissolution of the Templars. Don Carlos had already left their ranks to become a scholar. Don Carlos? Is he the guy who went missing? Si, uh, but he had reckoned without the local bishop. The bishop envied us our lands and determined to use the papal edict as an excuse to destroy us. Don Carlos was on one of his scholarly journeys when the Inquisition arrived. When Don Carlos returned, it was to find his loyal manservant slain and his children gone. They took the kids? But why? Oh, we will never know. The bishop denied all knowledge of the children's disappearance. But witnesses had seen his men kill the servant who had been charged to protect them. What happened to Don Carlos? Uh, he swore he'd find his children if he had to go to the edge of the world. He put on his armor and took up his sword and shield and rode out alone. He was never seen again. Ah, Lopez, you have the pieces. See, si, my lady, as you asked. Por favor, Senor Stobart, would you be so kind? My lady. Calm yourself, Lopez. I believe Senor Stobart's motives are pure. Very well, my lady. If a bit self-interested. My lady seems to trust you. But you don't. No, Senor. It fits, Senor Stobart. It fits. Working quickly, I found which pieces went into which holes. Ah, they changed this puzzle, too. That sucks. Each piece must be placed in the corresponding hole. Come in the unplaced pieces and turn to reveal. Likewise, checking on the holes, but da, 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 da. Okay. Anyway, yeah, because in the original, it had kind, of, it showed up, you know, not a, ch a chessboard, but not like this. It was more of a, uh, it looked more like the 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 dais that was on, and it, the chess pieces were. Um, I can't remember the name of it, but like that famous old English uh, chess, you know, chess board pieces with like, you know, the sitting king and all that. And it was really cool. So it kind of sucks that they turned into this really bland, I want to say almost like Android app chess game thing. So let's see where we can find where these go. That what?
that what exactly is it trying to do? So that has to go. What? That goes. Are you gonna let me grab it? They turned it into a color matching game. But, like, I can't grab the pieces. Oh. Okay. That is a weird way to do it. Although, also, I kind of remember that the... No. The, uh... Okay, that didn't go there. The puzzle was kind of hard, but, I mean, it wasn't... You know, what you could do it, it just was kind of a little confusing. This is just... This is stupid. Especially being I can't grab the pieces half the time. There. That's... That was stupid. Poorly designed, too. ...in place, the square bases fit onto the white pieces. I just had to figure out where to place them. That, yeah, and also because, like, it... I think it moved the, uh... height of some of the pieces here, so... Bingo. I mean... Checkmate. Okay. So... And we get that. Senor Stobart, look! What is that? It's not... It's not the Holy Grail, is it? No, Senor Stobart. It is the communion chalice of the De Vasconcelos. Missing for almost 700 years. Wow! Well, go on. I... I cannot. I can hardly believe it is real. Ah, go ahead. Live a little. Are you sure? This is your moment of triumph, Senor Stobart. Sure, I'm sure. Besides, you're not going to live much longer anyway, so live a little for the little bit you got. The possibility of death traps only occurred to me a few days later. <laughs> So the curse of the De Vasconcellos is lifted? Oh no. The Countess was thrilled to find the lost chalice. But there's still the riddle of the missing knight. Well, you can forget about that now and get back to finding the Templar's secret. Uh, actually, I promised the Countess I'd find Don Carlos. You what? I can explain everything. You have got the odds for a withered old Spanish aristocrat? No. The Countess entrusted me with the chalice and... The quest for her ancestor's tomb. You're as crazy as she is. Haven't you got enough problems? Khan and the Templars? It's all part of the same thing. The chalice is important, I'm sure. The manuscript pointed us to the knight, and I have to find him. What then? I don't know. But when the knight and the chalice are reunited, maybe I will. Okay, well, anything else? Is there something going on between you and Labano? What business is it of yours? We agreed all this. The clown, the Templar, strictly business, remember? Yeah, but... So get off my case! Fine, and... Uh, it's not going to be the same thing. Do you think the assassin was... Yeah, it's the same. Besides my... It was... He was... Well, uh, let's talk about the chalice. This is the chalice I discovered in Spain. The chalice in the palace. I still can't figure out why the Countess gave it to you. After losing it for all those years, she simply gave it away to a total stranger. She's one prawn shot of a paella. The Countess is a fine lady. You shouldn't compare her with seafood. I wouldn't be surprised if there's something going on between you and that Countess. No. Are you serious? She's old enough to be my grandmother. Well, that's it, I think. I'd better get back to the quest. But let us go, I think, I think here is where we need to go. But I will leave that till next time. Hope you all enjoyed, and in the next one we will continue the adventure. Until then...